Hi guys and welcome back to another video. This is a very special video for me because I've been planning this video for around three months now. Um, I am going to be showing you for the first time ever my stationery subscription box. So this box has been in the making since March. So I collaborated with Arumi on this box. Now I'll have all her contact details um, in the description box below. So please go check it out. She's also a small business owner. She's got an Etsy shop, a website. And I wanted to tell you a bit about the story of how we actually collaborated to make a quarterly stationery subscription box. Um, also, I haven't seen this box yet, so that's why I'm very excited to open it up on camera. Everything's getting shipped to a roomie's house, so I haven't actually seen the design on the box like in person, <laughs> even though I've been involved throughout the branding and the illustrations and the manufacturing and the production. I've been throughout, involved throughout the whole process. I actually haven't seen everything that will actually get sent to our customers just because um, plans got changed a bit. I was supposed to go down and help a roomie pack all the boxes, um, but due to COVID that didn't happen this time around. So she has kindly sent me the box um, so I can show you guys on camera. So before I get started and before I open the box up, I wanted to tell you a little bit about the journey and the story. Now I'm going to have time codes in the description section. So if you do want to skip past this part, you can, you can go straight to the unboxing. I won't be offended. Um, but I thought for anyone who's running the small business or just wanting to know the journey of how we got started, um, yeah, I thought I would share that with you because it has been a incredible journey. So let's get started. In March, a roomie actually messaged me on Instagram. We'd been following each other at this point, but we'd never really spoken before. She direct messaged me on Instagram and she said she had a few questions about shipping. Now we're both in Australia, so um, I said to her, send me through an email of what you're wanting and I'll see if I can answer your questions for you. So there was a bunch of questions um, that she had and I thought, well, she's a small business owner as well. So it might be nice to jump on Zoom. So we got on Zoom, I think the next day and we spoke to each other for like hours. <laughs> so I think we set aside like an hour to begin with and we ended up on Zoom for like three or four hours just chatting. And I got off Zoom and I was like, Dan, talking to my partner, I was like, Dan, I just met like a really cool chick in Australia that's also running a small business and we've got so many ideas of things that we can help each other out for our businesses. Now, throughout this Zoom session, we actually said that we both wanted to make a subscription box for a really long time. And together, like I've got kind of like the marketing sales side, she's got the design illustration side, and we thought it would be a really fun idea. So to begin with, um, I just said that I'll send her a few ideas over email and we originally thought we were going to partner with a bunch of Australian small business owners, but we figured out that it would be a lot easier to do it just with the two of us. We decided to go through and figure out like the budget of how this would all work out and we both needed to invest um, a lot of money up front in order to get everything like manufactured to invest in. Um, all the basic things that you need to do when you're starting a new business venture. So at this point we had a really messy Google Doc Drive of just like brain dump, like all of our brain dumps were just on there. Arumi did then um, go through and like organize it, but it was still very messy. So I created one of those Notion pages. Um, I'd actually seen another YouTuber organize their life through Notion. Um, so that's when I created a Notion page so then we had a space for everything. So we then had a space for finances and expenses, profit losses and all that. Um, we had a brain dump section, we had like a Monday night Zoom meeting section. So we started to put things in place to structure the business and we decided to meet up on Zoom every Monday night and this is an ongoing thing now. So. Since March, we've been meeting um, on Zoom every Monday night. We've decided to jump on at 7.30 and we talk until like 10.30 at night time um, because we're not only just talking about like production and what needs to happen for the box, 
but we're also running through things like tips and tricks for each other's businesses. So something that might have helped my business, I'll tell her. Something that might have helped her business, she'll tell me. So not only are we growing my stationary subscription, we're also helping each other out on the business side of things. And it's really great to have someone to bounce back ideas off because being a small business owner, you can feel alone a lot of the time, um, especially when the people around you aren't doing what you're doing because you have to be on schedule, you're consistently producing products, you're trying to market yourself, manage the money, make all the content and it can get quite overwhelming when you feel like you're doing it alone. So finding someone that I can talk to like every Monday night and we do text like all the time, um, sorry, like DM each other on Instagram like all the time. So um, it's just really nice to have another person. It feels like we're a team now for our businesses. And we went through the entire designing of the website first. So we spent days, like not only just like Monday nights going through the website, but we spent days just like organizing the website, layout, perfecting the illustrations and working on the logo. So you guys, I'll show you the logo in a second, but it's the two of us popping out of a box and then it's also the two of us illustrated as these little characters holding an envelope because in the my stationary subscription um, we've got two tiers so you could either go for the box or the package so once we launched the website and sorry once we had the website finished and the logo finished and we knew roughly what our schedule was for making products we then launched and it was so exciting to launch we had secret passwords and um, it was just yeah overwhelming of the amount of people who signed up for our launch day um, and then also the people who consistently supported us and shared what we were doing it was a really incredible way to launch a business so we launched and then we had to really hit hard on production so once we launched and we got the money for the um, products then we had to go into production and we had a few delays in getting the box because it actually took a really long time to get the box manufactured, created and sent to us. So there were a few little hiccups, but I would say the whole process was pretty smooth. Um, we did have a few errors when it came to shipping. So Australia shipping prices has changed a lot since March um, because of COVID. So we had to really figure out how to integrate the shipping for our annual boxes. So there was a lot of logistical conversations that we had on Monday nights, just like headaches of just trying to figure out the logistics of how we were going to get this box out to um, a global um, community. And then we also had to, design, to desi decide, <laughs> decide on things like themes, illustrators. So we actually wanted to collaborate with um, small business owners because that's the whole identity of our business is we want to support other small business owners so that's really what we want to do we really want to support small businesses by getting their illustrations and their designs in our box each um, each quarter but we also be wanting to promote illustrators and designers that are just starting out as well so that's the whole reason that we wanted to um, like that's our brand identity and why we want to do this box because we know how hard it is ourselves to run a small business and if we can support these people through these boxes and get these names out there to um, people who sign up for my stationary subscription, you guys who are customers get to see new illustrations and designs each quarter um, and the small businesses benefit because we'll be doing all the marketing promoting for them. So we feel like this is a good business model. Um, we really feel like we're doing it for the people and we absolutely love our products. <laughs> we generally love our, every single product we put in here, which is the heart and soul of curating this box. Um, so yeah, I think I went on a bit of a tangent there, but yeah, we came to the point where we released it. Now we've started shipping out our boxes to customers. The last day you can purchase this box, this specific one here, this kawaii themed box is the 31st of July. So this video will go up tonight. Um, so you guys have around two weeks if you want to get it. We only have around, um, I think 20 boxes left. I'll have to double check that because 
we have sent this box out to a few influencers who will be promoting as well. Um, but yeah, we'll be this one will end on the 31st of July if you want to go check it out. And then the next box will be a snail mail pen pal theme. <gasps> it is so cute. I'll put like a sneak peek up on camera now. So pause the video if you want to go check out our illustrations for the next box. Um, we honestly think it's going to sell out really quickly because the illustrations, designs and the ideas we have it for it is so cute. Um, and it's, they're only limited edition prints, so you can't get this stationery outside of the quarter that we send it out. Um, so yeah, if you want any of the stationery in these boxes, you need to buy them in the quarter. We may have past boxes if we have extra products, um, but yeah, if we sell out, we sell out. You won't be able to get these illustrations or designs ever again. So I highly recommend you grab them before they sell out um, because we're not remaking them. So I think that's everything I needed to tell you guys. I will have a discount for you in the description box if you want to go purchase. But let's jump right in and let's have a look at the box. Okay, this is the exciting part because like I said, it has been since March like producing this box and I haven't seen the actual box yet. And a lot of the items I haven't seen. I've just seen the samples that we've been taking photos of. So there's still so much in here. Now I've already opened up like plenty of these and used them. So I'm going to keep this one package so we can use it um, later if we want. But she's included the thank you Brittany. So a lot of people will get little thank you cards. Um, and yeah, it's really adorable. I'll put some footage on the screen now of me using the bag. But yeah, I really like how she's packaged it with our two little faces. <laughs> Oh my goodness, look at this gorgeous box. Seeing our product come to life, I think that's the thing that's really exciting because this is what people will be getting. All right. And it's really good quality. Okay, cute, nice little touch with the bubble wrap. So then we've got our thank you card. Again, it's us. And then it says, thank you for supporting our small business. See, that's the colour that I thought the box was going to be. You can see um, it's a lot lighter. And then on the back, we've got the illustrators, creators, and then we support independent artists and small business owners. So that's kind of like our motto of this business. So it's got the tissue paper our little seal for the tissue paper. I really just didn't stick it on because I still need to take a few more photos. Oh, this is so nicely wrapped. I really done such a good job. So we've got our washi tapes. Um, and again, we've got our cute little logos on the top. It's just really cool to see everything finished and finalized. Um, so this is our little cat keychain. And then we've got the gorgeous die cut stickers. Now I've already seen these ones, so that's why I'm not reacting like, oh my God, it's brand new. <laughs> we've got the two shiny ones. So the little hedgehog in a bath, the little planner. They're really cute. And then these ones are the matte ones. So the envelope and the cat. So yeah, I've been putting these everywhere. <laughs> Then we've got the little memo sheets and then on the back is our mail tag. So you can actually add this. Now, not all of our boxes are going to be relating around snail mail. Um, we were even discussing on Monday that we might have a few things that are more um, directed towards like planner community. So stay tuned for that and go check out our Instagram, like follow us on Instagram for sneak peeks. We do sneak peeks all the time. All right, these turned out really cool, but the colors just, yeah, look incredible. So very, very nice. And then oh, I haven't seen these either. Okay, so we've got the hedgehogs thinking about you, the little bathtub, stay cute. Oh, these are really lovely. All you need is stationery. This is one of my favorite ones. I think I'm going to put this straight into my planner. Hello, friend. Sent with love. The little cat. The 
the bread and then we're back to the hedgehog. These are going to be really nice to send out. Okay, lovely. And I have to say, Arumi, if you're watching this video, you've done such a good job at wrapping. Everything's to like perfection. <laughs> okay, so oh, the envelope quality is really nice. Oh, the letter writing paper, I think, is my favourite. The quality is so good. It turned out really, really awesome. And I love the little detailing of the hearts. Oh, this is so cute. And then the letter paper, it's such good quality. Okay, love, 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 love. I think that's everything. Thank you so much for watching this video today. I hope you enjoyed listening to our story and seeing me open up this box for the first time. I just, yeah, I'm really proud of how far we've come and what we've created. It's so cool to see it in person and to, yeah, see all the stationery that we've been designing for months. So again, thank you. And if you want to grab this box, you've got till July 31st and then we'll be releasing the next one. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.